All right, today we're going to talk about the fingering of the Aeolian mode in the key of G. Now, we've been working our way up, up the neck in, with all the modes. So we have the, the G major scale, G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. We're going to start on the sixth degree, because remember, a mode is just the same scale, but started on another degree of the scale. Okay? So we're starting on the sixth degree, and this is called Aeolian. And we're going to have our hands in this position right here. Our first finger is going to be on the 12th fret, and of course our other fingers will take care of the notes on their aligned frets. Okay? So the pattern for this is one, three, four. Next string, one, three, four. Next string, one, three. Now we're going to slide down a fret, changing positions on the next string. I'm going to go one, two, four. But then we're going to go back up to the next string, one fret, back to where we were in position. And we're going to go one, three, four. And then on the sixth string, one, excuse me, one, two, four. One, three, four on the first string. So let's run that again. One, three, four, one, three, four, one, three. Slide down. One, two, four. Slide up. One, three, four. One, two, four. Keep doing that. One, three, four. Okay? And that is the Aeolian mode. And... Next time we uh, get together, we're going to do the Locrian mode, the final mode, the seventh mode of the major scale. And we have, we'll have covered the whole neck with the G major scale. And actually, once you learn those positions, the, it's almost like a slide rule. You can slide it to any key. This applies to every key. Okay, So this is why it's very important to learn each mode. But really get it under your fingers, understand it, get it comfortable. Okay, And uh, I'll see you for the Locrian mode later.